Oh look, he's like wearing little socks. Hey guys, I'm Pixel Posey. Thanks for joining me. Today I'm going to be playing some more Age of Empires 2 Definitive Edition, so let's get to it. Alrighty guys, so today I'm still gonna do another skirmish like I have been doing. Um but today I'm going to do something a little bit different. I am actually going to try it on moderate difficulty. If you have watched my previous five videos, I think it is, I have been playing um, like each different civilization um, on standard difficulty. And I have won every game so far. Um, so I don't want... Like I still want to sort of test out each civilization. So I'm just trying to think of different ways to do that um, without you guys getting too bored. Because I'm sure it's going to get a bit boring for you guys to keep watching me win all the time. I'm sure you guys want to see me lose. Um, so that's what I've come up with. Um, yeah, it like standard, it's good for beginners. Like I, I'm definitely a beginner. Um, so it is good that it's, um, like they don't really attack you until you attack them kind of thing. Like they, they, they give you plenty of time to sort of prepare yourself, um, to go and attack them. So it's very, very slow paced. Um, uh, which, yeah, which is good if you, if you're sort of learning to play the game, which I am. Um, but it's also, it's just like I said it's not very entertaining for you guys see like my whole point is to entertain you guys um and if I sort of yeah win every game that's that's gonna get boring um it's also gonna get boring for me as well and yeah I definitely I don't want to feel bored playing these games um so that's what I'll I'll try and do for this one um I really it doesn't worry me um if I win or lose it, it honestly doesn't worry me um I'm still here to sort of to learn how to play the game. I'm still here to try each civilization um, and also try different maps as well, uh, which is what I've been doing. Every time I try a new civilization, I've been trying a different map, um, which is um, always fun to do. Um, so, so yeah, that's, that's what I'm going to try to do today. Like I said, I don't really care if I win or lose. It's just, yeah, all about having fun and entertaining you guys. Um, so yeah, let's start the game. Um, so I'll just double check. Yeah, so yeah, the previous one I did Bulgarian, so I am up to Burmese. Okay, I just wanted to double check that. Uh, so this one's a monk and elephant civilization. Um, it's probably uh, not really a good idea to try moderate on with a civilization I've never played before, but anyway it doesn't really matter um actually the unique unit is a ranged cavalry that sounds interesting um but anyway we'll give them a go and yeah we'll just see how different standard and moderate is um so i've also been um uh, practicing my build order um, as well uh, so if you um, see me look down I've actually made notes <laughs> I'm tr I've, yeah like made notes of a build order for this game uh, so if you see me looking down I'm reading my notes because I'm trying to memorize it so I can get like faster and faster at this game um, so that's what I'm doing if you see me looking down I actually have only sort of written notes down um, up until advancing to the feudal age. So anything that I do after the feudal age is I'm just gonna like be winging it. <laughs> I'm not gonna have any idea what to do or anything. So I'll just be making it up as I go. Um, I just didn't want to overwhelm myself by writing down this whole long list of yeah build orders. So I'm just starting off with, um, up to the feudal age first, uh, just yeah, so I can sort of learn that and sort of perfect that, and then I will try and then um, do the the next age after that. Try and um, 
memorize like a build order for that as well. So that's what I've been practicing on lately. Uh, you may have seen my video where I did the Fast Castle Age um, learning campaign in the Art of War. Um, that's sort of yeah where I'm sort of getting the build order from. Um, okay, so I'm talking too much and I'm not concentrating. Uh, anyway, so I need I need to find my the rest of my goats. Oh, sheep in this one. Okay, fair enough. So I'm trying to remember to to scout around. I'm not. I know you've probably seen me just use just whack it on auto scout and and away he goes. Well, I've since kind of learned that that is not a great idea when you're first starting because you need to find all your little sheep. Okay, so I've got what am I what am I up to? So three on wood research. Loom. And you can build a house. Okay, now my berry bushes. Where are they? Right there. Okay, and there's some more sheep. Have to lure this boar soon. Okay. Use this guy a little ball. Okay. Yeah, I've definitely been practicing my build order. Okay. I know a lot of you guys have sort of been telling me that I need a build order. And I kind of I understand that now. understand that like every every step that you make the beginning of the game is sort of yeah it's crucial um, so yeah I'm getting there I, I think I'm definitely improving with um, with the game well hope so anyway no a lot of you guys have told me that I am improving so that's good to hear I like to hear stuff like that because yeah it's hard to tell yourself whether you're whether you're improving or not so it's nice to hear um, people tell you that that I'm definitely improving in the game so thank you for those lovely comments I really appreciate it okay so now I need to... Oh, I forgot to make my mill. Is he talking and not concentrating? So yeah, I have no idea how long I'm going to last in this game, but like I said, it doesn't really matter. It honestly doesn't matter. Like, it's all about having fun, so... But oh, moon attacked. Oh my goodness. Okay, well I found him. He's very close in this map. Why did I pick this map? <laughs> okay, well since I think I've found all my sheep. So I might just chuck this guy on... Oh, it was a relic. On auto scout. I think I found them all. I can't quite remember. But anyway. Okay, so I should have made another house by now. Okay, so I'll go up to feudal. Uh, now, if I remember correctly, in the fast castle um, tutorial, it made me make eight farms. But I'm gonna wood. Oh, actually, my second ball. Oh dear, dear, dear. Silly mistakes like this. 
Oh, I should have actually killed that bull before I made bombs. Okay, again, I'm not really concentrating. Okay, so you guys can kill the bull. water in this one. Okay, so I've ad advanced, or nearly advanced, uh, to feudal, so anything after this I'm just going to be making up because <laughs> I haven't really been um, practicing any sort of, of build order after the feudal age, so yeah. <laughs> Sorry about that guys, I know it'll probably be like, painful for you to watch me make all these mistakes, but anyway, just take it one step at a time. Okay, I do remember from Fast Castle, um, I have to make Blacksmith and Market. I will do that as soon as my little dudes pop out. So he can build a blacksmith. Oh, and also I need to build a second lumber camp as well. Yes, because see now I haven't got enough wood to build my markets, which I should have had enough wood by now. But I forgot to make more wood choppers. But that's my fault. Okay, so very yeah, I might I might actually build another llama camp up here. Although hang on, that's where are they? No, that it's too close. I um, might send them okay. over here. <laughs> okay. Okay, so these guys can. Okay. Chop wood over here away from the enemy. Okay, so they should be safe over there for a little bit anyway. Okay, so I think a market 175, perfect. With that. Also should be starting on gold. Track three on gold. Hey. Still very close to him. Not much I can do about it, unfortunately. Okay, so I might, um, yeah, I might do more farms. Yep. 
I think in Fast Castle Age, it actually, it told me to upgrade something in the Lumber Camp, but I don't seem to have that with this civilization. So I guess I won't worry about it. I might focus on archers, although this civilization Monk and Cavalry, wasn't it? Maybe I should focus on Cavalry. Cavalry, so I might actually... Hey, okay. I might do some more farms. advanced um I might chuck a few more on gold as well okay Solo might actually build another mining camp down here because that's a bit close to those um to the enemy I think that'd be a bit safer down this way Chuck another, maybe even another five. Uh, yeah, another five on gold, maybe. All right, I probably should. I might have to borrow one of these guys. And start building barracks. Because I'm sure it won't be long before they start attacking me. <laughs> what are you doing, you stupid scout? <laughs> Just running down the middle of their place. Run! Oh look, all oh, the water. Quite a few trees in the middle. This is an interesting map. Yeah. Yeah, they're interesting buildings. I love seeing what the buildings are going to look like with each different civilization that I play. That's why I like, you know, going through each one, like I want to play each one just to sort of experience, um, yeah, what like what their buildings look like and their different units and stuff like that. Hey. Okay, so the little village is popping out, so that's good. Hey. Okay, things are coming along nicely. They got a dock and everything. Okay. Okay, so I'm just not sure how many more villages you need to make. But I know the more the better, of course, but like I don't want to go overboard. I'm not sure where I'm being attacked. I don't know if that was just my scout or not. But I probably better okay. hurry up and get organized. Right, so things are coming along, coming along nicely. I do say so myself. Okay. 
Oh, on my stone. Oh, look at the little elephant! Oh my god. Oh my god, okay. I'm gonna have to create some battle elephants, like, come on. I'd be stupid not to. <laughs> Uh, let's do it. Oh my goodness. Okay. This is gonna be cool. Oh good. Well, Archer's ready. <laughs> okay, so those elephants actually Oh look at him! Oh my god, he's so cute. Oh look, he's like wearing little socks <laughs> or something. <laughs> okay. Um, yeah, like I was saying, they actually pop out quite quickly too. Um, they're quite expensive, so 110 food. So I might throw down some more farms. Just to pay for these bad boys, because they are gonna cost me a fortune. But I'm quite impressed how quickly they pop out. I might just kind of create a little bit of a a wall of houses here. So I did actually choose moderate difficulty, didn't I? Because I just feel like by now they should have been like attacking or something. I don't know if there's any way to check. I just thought, like, by now, that would have been, like, okay. killing me for sure. Because, like, now that I think of it, I, I can't even remember whether I chose, um, whether I actually chose moderate. I was talking about it, but I can't actually remember if I chose moderate or <laughs> if I was just talking about it. Oh no, here they come. Okay. Let's test these um, elephants out and see what they can do. Because I'm, I'm not actually sure what, what they're best against. Because it's not telling me, you know, like if they're, they're best against like archers or cavalry or whatever. Uh, I'm gonna spit more of those out. Um, I wonder if I should actually like create some walls. Like seeing as I am playing moderate. Well, I think I'm playing moderate. Okay, let can we upgrade these elephants? Yeah, I probably have to go up to the next age though before I do that. Okay, so I'm probably gonna have to build. Come on, little elephants. Down we go. They're so cute. Oh, yeah, look at that. They got that knight in no time. Okay. Okay, cool. Um. Oh, that is a big castle. Alright, let's put it on this side. Oh, I didn't see that guy down there. Okay, but we have to replace. I know they killed a couple of villagers. Um, okay, now I made you for a reason. I can't, but, oh, I think I was gonna get you 
to put up some walls. Follow you, Bama. I really want to upgrade these elephants, but we need to advance first. Is there anything in the market? So they don't specifically say elephants, just say infantry, cavalry. They're just, they're just gonna keep getting slaughtered over there. Oh no, they got my dude that was getting, um, building a castle. It's not good. to Imperial now and then I can upgrade my elephants create Arambai okay so that's my unique unit so let's have a look and see what they do how good are these guys against buildings I think they'll be pretty good they're elephants after all. Okay, so there's my Arambai. Oh yeah, he pegs stuff at people. <laughs> Radio. Good to know. Build another um, oh, stable. Follow you, Me nor they, man. Those elements are cool. I'm liking those. Hey. They are very close. Yeah, I'm gonna need backup people. Okay, let's see how well these elephants get buildings. Not fantastic, but okay, okay. I've got enough of Okay, so we've got two stables going now. Okay, so I need 700 100 gold to upgrade my elephants, so I'm gonna need a whole lot more gold. I still think I need more farms too, because those elephants are expensive. 
back here, dude. Yeah, they are good against those knights. Okay, so is there any upgrades I can do? Gold mining. saving up the 700 gold because I'm using the gold to actually train the elephants. That's yeah a bit annoying. Fantastic against buildings. So I suppose if you had a lot of them, they would be. But that guy's going up to my wood choppers. Gold, what's going on? Why is why am I suddenly ran out of gold? Oh look how fancy they are now. Oh they're really fancy. Priest, better not. Okay. 
convert my elephants or I will be annoyed. What are they doing here? Building a wall like right in the middle of my place. Like get out of here. How are these guys going? I definitely gonna need some more. I could probably even take, yeah, you know what? I could take, I've got so much wood. I can take away some of my wood choppers and um, turn them into gold miners. Because I do not need that much wood, especially if I'm just gonna make elephants, which is food and gold. And I really need to repair that castle. I can't believe they just built a, like a gate right there. What I could even do is just chuck another castle <laughs> right there I don't know if it's overkill but anyway okay so I've got a lot more gold miners now might even upgrade it Seeing as I'm using archers, I will make sure I upgrade them in here. See, I'm not sure if these upgrades help the elephants. Um, because you're making the elephants in the stable, I'm not sure if they benefit from these cavalry upgrades. I don't know if someone in the comments can tell me. Um, like how I can upgrade the elephants more. around okay they're persistent they're determined that they want this uh, wall there okay so that second castle should help get those villages they're determined to build that wall Okay, they've even got like this random gate just here, you know, so why not? <laughs> bad against the buildings like you kind of need a lot of them to do any damage I'll make some um, siege weapons just to give them a hand Oh, 
moderate difficulty because I really thought for sure that they would were gonna slaughter me. That would be so embarrassing if I, I thought that I'd selected moderate and I hadn't really. It sounds like something I'd do though. Because I remember talking about it but I can't actually remember whether I, I changed it. Because like why uh, like why am I winning? <laughs> Just I don't know if there's any way to check what settings I put it on. Even if I, I did forget to change it to moderate, it doesn't matter because the whole point was just to test out the next civilization anyway. And a, in a different map, so. That's all good. That's exactly what I've done today. I love these elephants. These are really cool. Usually like an archer type of person, I love to sort of like stand back and attack, you know, from a distance, but I'm really, really liking these elephants. I might be converted to um, elephants instead of archers, you never know. by accident. Okay. That's all good. Look at all my elephants. <laughs> oh look, elephantastic. I just got a reward in Steam. Elephant elephantastic. <laughs> that is cool. I don't think I even need to make any more elephants, I just want to for the fun of it. <laughs> like usually, usually they've surrendered by now. I'm not sure why they haven't. I've probably got another town center somewhere. Yeah, so let me know in the comments, guys, if um, these blacksmith upgrades benefit elephants at all. Yay, Victorious! Cool. Now I'm really curious to know if <laughs> that was on standard or moderate. I have no idea. If it was on moderate, I'm quite impressed with myself to have completed that on moderate. If it's on standard, meh. It's not really that surprising. But anyway, let's go back to the main menu. I did! I, I did put it on moderate. Okay. I just completed that on moderate. Wow. 
I'm quite impressed with myself. <laughs> I really did not think, I thought that would like wipe me out in like 10 minutes. Interesting. Okay, that's, that's good to know. I know this, that's probably not going to happen every time, of course, like all games are different, but still I'm quite impressed with myself to have finished that on moderate. Excellent. Okay, I really enjoyed that one. Those elephants are really cool. I like them a lot. They probably almost have converted me from archers to elephants, but we'll see. We shall see. Anyway, thanks so much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, please like, comment, and subscribe. I really appreciate it. And next time, uh, I'm not sure what I'll do. I might continue on um, with just um, with doing the different civilizations. Um, if you're enjoying watching that, please let me know. Um, I'd like to hear some ideas on what you guys would like to see me play in this game. Um, whether you want me to go back to like campaigns or stick with the, the skirmish games or whatever, please let me know because I, I, I want to play what you guys want to watch. So anyway, I hope you guys have a great day. I'll see you next time. Bye!